Hello everybody, my name is Ranjita Sen and I work for the National Health Service, the NHS, and I've worked with the NHS for the last 16 years. My job title is Associate Director for IT Application Support, Performance and Information. Prior to joining the NHS, I worked in a number of different industries, uh, including the civil service, uh, credit rating and insurance, all roles that demanded a great degree of analytical and numeracy skills. I started off as analysts, in different roles and then progressed on to senior analyst, consultant and then eventually managerial roles. I studied a BSc in chemistry and a master's in statistics at University College of London and I was aware at that time that given my background in two very numerate degrees it put me in a very good position to be able to apply for jobs and careers in a wide range of industries. I could see openings in many industries such as pharmaceuticals, finance and banking for numerate graduates and I eventually got offered a role with the Fast Track Government Statistical Service and joined a civil service department known as HMRC, Her Majesty's Revenue and Customs. Very early on in my career I was working directly with the European Commission on VAT accounting and policy. After my civil service career, I progressed on to careers in the credit rating and insurance industry and my statistical and analytical skills were put to good use. Recent experience with COVID was something we could never have planned for. As a team, we had to adapt very quickly to very new ways of working whilst maintaining business as usual for our frontline staff and patients. We had to ensure that our frontline teams had access to good, accurate uh, data on patient pathways, even though we may have temporarily paused pathways in order to accommodate uh, new ways of working and, of course, COVID. We had to develop and maintain our systems to be able to accurately report on patients uh, and make sure that we didn't lose patients in the process. All of that had to happen at a time when we were also, uh, as a team, adapting to very new ways of working. Uh, we were starting to work from home, so I had to ensure that my team were equipped with the right facilities and technology, and that we were able to hold regular forums and meetings to discuss key progress with programmes, projects and other pieces of work. I would say is that if you enjoy numerate subjects, if you've got a numerate background and you enjoy using numbers to make decisions, drive change or improve services, then you can rest assured that there are a variety of different disciplines waiting for your skills. Keep an open mind, ensure learning continues beyond school, college and university and constantly seek ways to develop yourself as it's the combination of these skills as well as your numeracy that employers will be looking for. So the best of luck to you all.